good evening to everyone today we are going to discuss how the external css has to be done there are two things that you have to keep in mind now there are two things that you have to keep in mind first one is you will have two files in this one you will have two files see it is not given here let me write it down here okay i will write the other code one minute i will write the other code here this file is called my style dot css what is my style dot css you see i will define all the styles you will open notepad how to define this one i will explain you first first to define the style file you will open notepad you will open notepad type the code what you see here then save the file as my style dot css here i am using the name my style dot css why because the you can see here my style dot css is used why because you can see the link here can you see the link here because i am going to use this style which i declare here in my main html program i am going to use the style which i declare here i will use in my html program that means i will have two files in external css the main difference is what i will have two files i will have two files one file is about one is html file one is html file the and the other one is css file dot css file or cascading style sheet file okay so you will have first you can either type the you can first type the html file this is html file you can see this is the html file you can type the html fi file first you can see normally html head head is closed here then you make this line see here you are going to make this line this line is actually very very important in ex in any cs external css file why this is going to link your style into this program from some other external file which is called style.css see here it is what href you know what is href it makes a link hyperlink or reference to this my style.css what is my style.css it is the file which has got all the styles declared which has got all the styles declared now if you can see here what what you can see here is that my style.css if you can see here now i actually have the body background color i changed h1 i changed all this type of things i have changed now what i want to do is that this line is very important if i want to use external css why because in external css you make the relationship with the style sheet and the text is it is a text file or a css file now you see it is a css file and i refer to this file my style.css don't think that only the name my style.css should come it can be my style1.css it can be my style2.css or it can be style.css it can be any name but whatever you are giving us a name here the same name you should give when you are defining your style and saving that file this is very 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 important that you have to keep in your mind now you can see here now i have a body and i have a body closed and h1 paragraph so this is a heading you know h1 is what black and big text p is what paragraph it's a bla paragraph black in color that's it but now it will come as what light blue Bo now you see the body i am actually changing the style for what body the body background color will be what light blue that means for if i use body here the body automatically will if i put body itself it enough what the body or background color will become what light blue because already i defined the style h1 the color is navy and left 
margin left is 20 points it will start from 20 pixels 20 pixels is what the point from where it will start that's called 20 pixels 20 pixels okay so this is called 20 px so now now you can see h1 will be what navy in color and it will start at the 20th pixel in the screen i give the margin as left and automatically when i put body the background color will be applied to the body which will be light blue in color now after this you will save this file as html file you will save this file as .css file and then when you open the html file you will see automatically this style which you have declared in the style.css will be applied in the html file i hope it's clear for everybody and if you have any questions please feel free to ask me thank you